now I am in the car park of uh, Central Plaza, Ramat Sri Branch. And yes, I'm wearing a mask. And I just want to see what's the situation in this mall. And what are they doing to stop people from going in or not. There's still a lot of cars in this car park. But this car park is usually reserved for people who want to park for two hours or less. So today they didn't even bother to give me a ticket. So let's help this guy go. Okay. Oh, there's a new shop here that sells clothes. Too bad. Moss Burger is open. No tables. Shops are closed. Shops are closed. Shops are closed. So this is a big electronic shop here. Cordon off, so I can't even go in. So, Mr. I is closed. There is cold stone, which is all cordoned off. Everyone is cordoned off, cordoned off, cordoned off. I guess I have to enter from here to so check my temperature. So let's have them check my temperature. I'll give him a sticker as well. So I'm back in this area where the shops are still business as usual. Nobody is allowed to sit here. No chairs. Shops are still selling everything. One of the bakeries is closed. But it looks like everything is normal here. Yeah, tops is very crowded and there's temperature checks and alcohol for you to use in many places. The bakery is here. Warapon is open. It's a very nice pow shop. Tops now, which is quite a big top it's in central. So, just want to see how stuck they are. Everything looks very stuck like a normal day. There's no difference. Bananas are full. Pineapple, coconuts, papaya, watermelon. Everything seems to be intact. So there is no difference. Life is as per normal. Something that they did recently in all parts is that they put a little window, like a glass, plastic door for all the foods. The frozen dog foods, fresh meats and fish. They never had before. Lots of sticks. Very good. Fish section. Very good as well. Fresh fish. So all these doors, since the COVID-19 started, they have installed all these. I think it's a good move. Everything feels more sanitary. Cleaner. Still a lot of people shopping. Everything is normal at Tops supermarket. So as I meander through the aisles at Top Supermarket, these are my thoughts. Nothing is changed. People are wearing masks. 
Keep it I'm wearing mask. The rare sight. All food places are open, but for takeaway only. And I now come out of tops, and I want to show you a different part. So this is an area usually reserved for events. This big space is for events, and right now they are using it as I think the takeaway counter for grab people or anyone who want to buy food. Oh, I think it's the order counter for the restaurants who are located upstairs of, of the mall. And you probably can rent a counter here to do your ordering from. It's pretty smart because the rest of the mall is shut, you see. The rest of the mall, every floor is shut. Nobody is allowed to roam or any shop allowed to open. So, six-storey mall, nothing is open except ordering of the food in this event area here. Shops are still open. Pharmacy, Katsuya. So, all the shops who are in the basement or the ground floor of this mall seems to be not affected but there are many many other restaurants on the 4th, 5th and 6th floor which is sealed off so they have to move the ordering counters here and I guess they still cook in their kitchens upstairs and they deliver down here to the grab drivers or the people who want to take away their stuff Incidentally I was approached by one of the central food court or the central plaza staff who says to ask me what am I doing with the videos here and another one is talking to me now. So now I should stop by other staff telling me that I can't be recorded inside here. When some of the staff said no problem, some of the staff here says I can't do it and I need to get approval. Which is very strange. From what I know this is a public mall and I have the right to, to video for my own use. Just been informed by one of the staff that I have to write in officially to say that I want to do a video here. So I have to leave now. And yeah, I guess this is a walkthrough of Central Rama 3. And Cat Shop is still open. So what I have learned from being here in the full-scale mall, Central Plaza Rama 3, is that they're quite smart. They shut down the whole mall except the ground floor, which has the supermarket and some pharmacies. And all the food stores on this floor are open for takeaway. And all the food stores that are not on the ground floor can have a space in the event area to set up a takeaway ordering counter for people to order and the kitchen will cook and set it back down for people to deliver it back to where they came from. Okay, so that's my mall review on day three of the shutdown of Bangkok. So they sealed off this area so that you cannot even get onto this area for this community mall which is just two storeys and this is the car park level where I am so I have to take the lift so the difference between this KFC and the rest of the KFCs is that this KFC here has a drive through so they do not need to open the counters at all. So you have to drive through, pay and collect at a window. So this is a lucky thing for them because they don't have to do anything indoors. Just continue business as usual for their drive through. The roads are very empty. 
can see there's a sign here. an extremely extremely hot day today I'm dying in this mask it's probably like 35 36 degrees Celsius here which is almost 100 degrees Fahrenheit so we are not from this part so ESP is open ESP 33 is open and they say 11 o'clock to 9 o'clock, they are open for takeaway. Okay. So if you need a beer, this is a good place to come and take away beer. Bangkok Bank <coughs> is open as well, but they are just limiting the amount of people going in. That's it. Courier services are closed and they don't ship face masks. That's a Japanese izakaya. Let's see whether it is open. I don't think so. Take home only. So you can have izakaya if you take home. Wow. I can't remember the last time I took home izakaya. Now, this is a new restaurant called Cafe Kyobong. New opening hours, and it does only take away. Dry cleaners, don't see it open. This is open for takeaway, no dining. Boon Tang Ki is a Singaporean chicken rice place. I'll probably order lunch here later. This is only for grab food and my man. The coffee shop that opens 24 hours. Now changes their time to 9 to 9 and take away the dry cleaning shop is open. I clean. So if you need to wash the clothes, this is the place to go to. So as I head back to head to another mall, I would like to add that the second floor of this mall is completely closed. Sorry, it's a bit dark. I'm going through a corridor here. All shops are closed, as expected. The Thai responded very fast and very well. Obeyed what the government asked for. No fighting, no illegal stuff. Everybody is cooperating with what the government asked them to do. Okay, so until the next mall. So now I am at a little community mall. So just a few shops here, restaurants, cafes, uh, courier service, a very good ramen place upstairs, Shabu Shabu, and a bistro, and most importantly, Top Daily. And a little so this is a very small community mall, a few car park lots. I come here a lot for food and tops. And let's see what's changed. They are still checking for parking, so they must expect a lot of people to come here to park for fun. So, as you can see, A Ramen is still open. There are people standing outside. Very good ramen. Terry parcel delivery service is still open. I can see at TBT people are walking around inside and doing the delivery stuff. I don't know why this is still allowed to be open. Maybe because the government didn't specifically mention that courier services cannot be open. As usual, tops daily and all supermarkets around Bangkok are fully stocked. Nothing is amiss. No space for anything else. Look. 
There's no worry. Guys, alcohol fully stopped too. Nappies fully stocked too. Eat all the essential items, including your oil and your sauces for the stock too. And everybody's favorite item to buy, toilet paper. Look at the stock. So I come to the last stop of the day. It's called Nang Lin Chi Community Mall. There is a Home Pro uh, Express here where I think people can still buy stuff but just not walk into it. It's a pick up area where they can shop for you. So there's a sign here that says whatever you need to buy, just tell us and we'll shop for you. So this is what Home Pro is doing during this time. Inside is all empty, there is nothing open. So that's quite a smart move. To the mall, get fresh, which is by dress, which the salad bar is open for takeaway. Swensen's, as usual, is open for takeaway. It's a company with a lot of grab drivers and people waiting outside. If you want to order from Greyhound, the order station is here. If you want to order from Kakonoya, the stations are here. So these are all the ones that are situated upstairs which is not open for public. Even this shop here as well is open because they are on the ground floor. Pretty similar to what we saw in Central Rama 3. Texas Chicken business is always crowded here, a lot of people will grab and food panda and line man doing up here. You see there's so many orders cooking up here. The eight orders cooking up here. Top supermarket is always crowded. But since they stopped giving plastic bags, it's harder and harder to buy more stuff here. So that's about it. I would say a very good it's very well stocked supermarket nothing seems to be missing as if it was the case for every other tops that I've been to today this mall is usually very very crowded because of its location it's, a, it's in the heart of a lot of a residential area many nice big houses and cool condos are around this area now I just like to walk around on the outside of this more to see what changed. So this is one of the cool and good cakes shops. They still have lots of stuff. The wine shop is also open and fully stocked. Monster tea. Kitchen and delivery. So, Home Pro, no access. And clothing shop is closed. So, further down, there will be a Starbucks and the Elephant Bistro. Let's see what's happening there. Elephant Bistro says they're open for takeaway only. Expected. Pretty good deal there. 50% promotions. Wow, well deal for 50%. Nice. Starbucks has no seats. Starbucks is a two story Starbucks here. This is a very cool Starbucks and it's always very packed. And now only for takeaway. You can also see Greyhound taking orders outside. They also have an ordering counter in the middle of the mall. This is a very good chain of Thai food. Started off as a clothing store. 
now back to get my takeaway order from Lot Mio. So while waiting for my food to be ready at Lot Mio, let me summarize what happened today. As COVID-19 cases in the world keeps rising, especially in Europe and the US, the US has gotten to like 30,000 incidences already. And because it's exponential growth, every day you get worse and worse before it gets better. So people in Bangkok, we are also struggling with this containment of the virus and we'll do what we can to limit the spread. So the government, three days ago, this is day three of the shutdown, has ordered all malls, massage places, non-essential businesses to be closed. The food places, supermarkets remain open, but only for takeaway. So let's hope this helps. I think my food is ready. I have to go feed the family. Signing off. Bye-bye.